Hello everyone, how are you? In this video, I am going to tell you how to install the Docker desktop on Windows operating system. So first of all, you need to go to any web browser and open this google.com and search for install docker desktop. Enter and you will see this first link. This link is also in the description. You can directly get from there as well. You need to open this first link which says install docker desktop on Windows. Click on this link. Then you will see few options. You need to click on the option number one which is docker desktop for windows x86 underscore 64 click on this and this will download the installing package or the installer package for docker which is basically for windows it is about 570 mb so it might take some time for you it took up around i think 30 seconds for me you can see once it is downloaded you just need to install it as a package so i think it is downloaded just you need to click this uh, i have clicked this i think it will open in some time so yes, I can see I have got this warning to run this application. You can run this application and once you run the application, you will see the installer window. So let me show you that it got opened on another screen. That's the installer window. Here you will have to first click on this OK button. Then it will automatically start the installing process. You can see that it is unpacking the files for the Docker desktop version 4.51.0. It will take some time. It will not happen in few seconds. It will take few minutes. So once the installation is done, I will come back and show you how to open this Docker desktop. So after some time, you will see this particular window which says installation succeeded. You must restart the windows to complete the installation. So you need to click on this close and restart. You need to restart your operating system. So after the restart, you can see that you have this Docker desktop icon on your desktop and this window will open automatically. You need to click on accept and after you click on accept docker installation is finally done that's what you will find this is the window which will open automatically this is the docker desktop window here you will have to first log in it is not compulsory to log in but you can log in using your work email or your personal email whatever you have registered if you don't want to log in now you can skip this process as well and now you can see this docker desktop done right you can see that it is saying WSL needs updating your version of Windows sub subsystem for Linux is too old. Run this command below to update for more information. We can just open a terminal. If this is for those people who are getting this particular error that WSL needs updating. Let me run this command WSL dash dash update. Click enter. It will do the updates Windows subsystem for Linux. And once this is done, we can click on restart. So let's wait for it to be 100% completed. The download is 100% done. Now it is installing the WSL system. So once this installation is done, let me restart. And now you will see that it is starting the Docker engine. So now everything is set up. Your Windows operating system is ready to run this Docker desktop. You can close the terminal for now. And after some time, you will see that your Docker desktop is now ready. You have this containers, images, volumes, Kubernetes and everything, right? This, these are all the options which Docker provide. So finally, we can say the Docker desktop is now installed in our system. Now, in this video, I've tried to explain the complete process. But still, if you're getting some error while installing Docker on your own operating system, basically the Windows operating system, then do let me know in the comment box. For now, if this video has helped you, then make sure that you hit that like button. And if you have not subscribed yet, then make sure that you do so. And I will see you guys in the next video. I want to see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching this one.